Hi, welcome back to Dr. Donovan Medicine Made Easy. In today's video, we're going to be looking at the clinical sign known as acanthosis nigricans. Acanthosis nigricans is the name given for dry, dark patches of skin that usually appear in the armpits, the neck, or the groin. It could also be a sign of an important underlying condition, and so these need to be checked out by a GP or a doctor if you notice them. So first of all, let's start off by discussing the signs and symptoms of acanthosis nigricans. Well, the main symptom of acanthosis nigricans are patches of skin that are darker or thicker than usual. They can appear on any part of the body, but they're most common in skin folds, such as the armpits, the neck, or the groin. People often comment that the patches feel dry or similar to velvet, and some people also notice tiny growths known as skin tags on the patches, as you can see on this photo on screen here. The patches often appear gradually without any other symptoms. However, sometimes the skin can be itchy. So let's discuss a little bit about what could cause acanthosis nigricans. Well, the most common cause of acanthosis nigricans is being very overweight. Other conditions include type two diabetes, conditions that affect hormone levels such as Cushing syndrome, polycystic ovary syndrome, or an underactive thyroid, taking certain medicines including steroids or hormone treatments like the contraceptive pill, and very rarely cancer, and this is typically stomach cancer. Also very rarely, you can have a faulty gene inherited from your parents which can cause acanthosis nigricans. However, it's also important to note that sometimes healthy people with no other conditions get acanthosis nigricans, and this is more common in people with black or brown skin. So what should you do if you notice these dark patches appearing? Well, although acanthosis nigricans is usually harmless, it's best to get these checked out by a doctor. Rarely, it can be a sign of something more serious, such as a cancer. Your doctor will usually be able to tell if it is acanthosis nigricans simply by looking at the skin and doing a clinical examination. However, you may need to do some tests to find out what's causing this underlying skin change. For example, if your GP suspects something like diabetes, they may then go on and order subsequent tests to try and confirm this, and this might include a blood test. Similarly, you should speak to your doctor if you've noticed new dark patches on your skin or you've got any skin changes that you're unsure about. In terms of treating acanthosis nigricans, well, once a health professional knows what's causing the acanthosis nigricans, then they can best recommend the treatment to manage the underlying disease. Typically, the patches should fade over time once the cause is treated. If you're very overweight, then your doctor may recommend losing weight, and they'll usually make sure that they put in a tailored program to help you do so. Depending on the cause, they may also recommend medicine to balance your hormones, medicine to balance your insulin levels if you've got something like diabetes, or changing your medicine to one that doesn't cause the patches. Importantly, there's no real specific treatment for the patches themselves. A skin specialist known as a dermatologist might be able to suggest treatments to improve their appearance, but finding and treating the cause is usually recommended first. I hope you found the video useful, informative, and helpful. If you want to find out more about acanthosis nigricans, I've included a link to the NHS website, as well as other useful resources that you can find in the description box of this video. If you did enjoy the video, please give it a thumbs up. Remember to subscribe to the channel for weekly medical education videos. And until next time, thanks for watching and bye.